hello guys welcome to another brand new video and, and today in this video i'll talk with you about chinese fake battery scam few months ago before this corona pandemic i bought this battery you see guys this is made in china battery okay uh okay so this is a made in china battery which i purchased from aliexpress and within few months this battery died it's not giving me any kind of backup Okay, this is a counterfeit battery of Sony NPF960. So if you buy this battery, original cost you a lot, three four thousand rupees. But I purchased it around I think thousand rupees. I purchased this battery for my LED light. As you see, guys, on this side, this is the LED light. I thought like it will be cheap and it can give me two three hours backup. I'm happy with that. But now it's giving me ten minutes of backup. So I decided to open this battery. And after opening the battery, I feel like I'm scammed. Here we have two plastic that are joined here. So if you use some kind of uh, screwdriver like this, uh, you can pray it. Like I've already opened this. So I'm showing you guys. Now what's inside it just. Okay. Now, as you see guys, we have here six total six one eight six five zero but these two batteries are dummy batteries i'm just going to peel it off okay so it's a battery or some kind of cylindrical metal what is this i don't know let's open it rj416 1865 yeah it's a dead battery i think and over this on this negative okay oh my god That's a dummy fake battery. Look at the battery. Is there any voltage? So there is no voltage. It's a dummy battery. Another one here. This battery is not even connected. It's just for increasing the weight. So both of these two battery is added just to increase the weight. And it's feel like kind of weighty and premium. Now these four are working batteries. Here we have a poor BMS. So uh, this kind of battery on local market you can buy it around 30-40 rupees. So it's around 40-40-160. So total battery cost them 200 rupees. And they are selling it around 1500-1600 uh, rupees. So 1000 rupees profit on a battery. Good, good, awesome business. Those Chinese sellers are really brilliant. They just want to make money and scam people. I have a couple of uh, new batteries. Those batteries are heavy. It's, its weight is around a little bit more than this. If I have a weight machine, I will show you the weight, but it feel like heavy. Wow, this four is uh, near about one and a half time heavy compared to these four batteries. So now what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to uh, desolder everything and I will address this Ford battery here so that I can use this battery again. So guys, let's fix it. Yeah, I cut my hand. Shit, man. I already disassembled the battery. And here, as you see, guys, this is the battery positive, battery negative, and this one. And this is for the balance charge. I check the voltage of these two batteries. The voltage is around 4 volt. But if I put some load, battery voltage drop rapidly. So there is not much capacity on these batteries, but we can use this battery on any other project. But this two battery is just for weight. Now we're going to solder uh, these two batteries. Now I'm going to use these six batteries. Uh, these four batteries are new batteries. This is from a old laptop. So these two batteries doesn't have much capacity. It is better to always use same batteries. Next I'm going to join these three batteries in parallel and these three. Then join these two batteries in series. So that gives me 7.4 volt. 
it's not a good idea to put solar on this battery because because the solar is hot and heat is not a ow <laughs> uh, and heat is not a good thing for a battery guys battery soldering is completed now we will check the voltage so we probably get 8 points of volt 8.2 8 volt so next uh, we need to adjust this BMS with the battery and then we will put this battery inside this and done so guys all of the soldering is completed now put inside this box Okay, it's like I think it's like this way now I'm going to use this E8000 glue to fix it here as you see it is open now I need to fix it this way guys finally i will to fix the battery because i need the battery today somebody request me to shoot a wedding and i don't have any extra battery and the battery died so somehow i fix the battery and it's going to work guys it's better than the battery i bought before it has a good quality battery and guys if you are thinking about buying cheap chinese product like this kind of cheap battery I recommend you don't buy it. buy something else guys it's a scam think twice before buying Chinese battery because whatever cheap Chinese battery I bought from Aliexpress they all stopped working within few months so it's not a good idea to buy battery from China so guys that's it for today hope you like this video if you like it make sure to smack a big thumbs up on this video and I will meet with you on my next video Till then, bye-bye.